War Dog Knife Sharpening. Today we're going to be reviewing this Winkler knife. It's a crusher belt knife. The steel is 80 CRV2. Um, it's 3 16 inches thick and then it's it's kind of narrowed down and thinned as you go out it towards the bottom. So it's got some black oxide on it. It's a no glare finish. It's got these camouflage G10 handles. There is jimping right here. So when you grab onto it, that jimping is feels about perfect. Fits really good. The handle fits really good. It's a nice G10. It's got a really nice finish on it. It's, a, it's handmade by Winkler Knives. I don't know if you can see that right there. Can't tell if it's focusing. Hopefully it is. But um, handmade in the USA. So it's all got a hand finish on it. Very nice quality. The AD CRV2 steel. It's a premium steel that they have there. Got a nice even bevel. Whoever sharpened it did a really good job. And then at this end of it is the crusher piece. This is the crusher belt knife. And so this is the window breaker right there. So whenever you have the knife, you need to break out a window. If you're stuck inside of a vehicle or something and you need to get out, then you have that to break windows with, or if you need to access something. So it's a good tactical tool to have, um, a good outdoor knife, tactical style knife. Uh, the length of the blade is four and a half inches. The overall length of the knife is nine and a half inches. So you got five inches from the end of your crusher to in here somewhere. I haven't measured it, but that's that's what they're telling us. So fits the hand really good. Uh, real grippy. I like the texture on that. Really nice pattern. This is the Winkler Crusher belt knife. It's got a really nice leather sheath here with a soft interior. There's a piece of leather. It looks like it's sewn. It looks like it's sewn into the inside. I don't know if you can really see it from that angle, but there's a hard piece of leather on the outside and then there's a soft piece on the inside. So Whenever you put this in, it fits really good. It's really a snug fit. So then you can pick this sheath up, shake it, whatever you want to do, and the knife's not falling out. So it's a really great fit. So whenever you want to go pull it out, I just take my thumb, push right here, because it is a good fit. And just slowly slide it back, and it comes right out. It's very sharp, so be careful. See that nice edge it has on it? So, I think this is my new favorite knife. It's the Winkler Crusher Belt Knife. It's got a spot for a lanyard back here. You can put a lanyard on it. Um, like I said, that back end works good if you need to, whatever you need to do tactile wise. It's going to come in handy. So on the on the back of the sheath, let's set this knife here. So on the back of the sheath, it's got a, a really well-built clip on the back of here. And then on the back side of the clip, there's a couple little metal retainers in there. 
so it's all premium quality it's not going to fall off you hook this thing on your belt it's not going anywhere it'll be there at the end of the day or if you want to hook it on a pack you can do that too it looks like it's set up to do whatever you want to do with it but this is my review on this Winkler Crusher belt knife war dog knife sharpening here um, great job guys whoever made this made in the USA handmade premium quality 3 16 of an inch thick black oxide no glare finish um, the G10 scales the handles um, all right well war dog knife sharpening thanks for tuning in like and subscribe